The eight hours of Silverstone was an amazing event for our SimHQ Motorsports team. Here's what happened. Hey everyone, I'm Troy Uyan and welcome to our race review for the VEC 8 Hours of Silverstone. I started the car 8th out of a 22 strong GT class and had a pretty frantic opening portion of the race. Several position swaps took place and I was in a nice battle with core team for most of the opening hour. You can click the link in the top right of the video to see all the highlights from the start and opening battles. Later on we passed SimTech on track before the stops and as we were going for the double stint strategy again, passed core team again in the pits. But to our surprise, SimTech did not take tires either and actually came out ahead of us after the stops, leading to another great battle. Ultimately I brought the car into the pits in 7th and Greg Hall took over from there. Conscious of our fuel situation, Greg was focusing on conserving fuel for his first hour of driving for our team. However, John on the pit wall told him to crank up the engine mode and go for it as championship leaders Pulse Motorsport were struggling with worn tires up the road in third. And what happened next was pretty epic because as Greg was catching Pulse Motorsport, Blackbird's Racing was catching up on both of them and the three of them came together and had a pretty sweet nighttime battle. Greg ended up in fourth when Jules took over and after that our race was one of strategy and consistency. Jules would slowly take third and then ultimately second in class before handing over to John for the final two hours. And John easily maintained that second position as we brought home our first VEC podium in just our third race. Hey, let me know in the comments below what you think of this new recap format along with the separate highlight clips. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.